Well, hello everybody and welcome to day 25 of my beginner sewing course. I hope you are well and today is exciting because we are learning how to make a scrunchie. So all you're gonna need is some fabric and a quarter inch wide elastic. So let's get into it. I'm working with satin, so I'll be using a needle for lightweight fabric. This will help the needle go through the fabric without destroying the weave, therefore leaving the fabric with no puckers or snags. Fold the fabric lengthwise, joining at the short ends. Use your preferred seam allowance and back tack at the beginning and the end of the seam. Open the seam allowance and press it. Flip the fabric over and join the top and bottom edges together. Wrap it as small as you can and bring the top and bottom edges of the lower side, joining them at the seam. Start sewing at the seam while making sure you don't accidentally sew over the folded fabric tucked in the middle. Once you reach the start of your seam, leave a 2 inch gap back tacking at the end. As you're sewing, pull the inside fabric towards you and keep the two edges together. Grab your elastic and poke a hole at one of its extremities. Place the hook of your loop turner inside the hole and insert the elastic in the scrunchie. If you don't have a loop turner, pin the elastic with a safety pin and pull it through the scrunchie. Overlap the extremities of the elastic together and pin it in place. Start by securing with a straight stitch to make it easier and then continue with a low width zigzag stitch to ensure a strong seam. Back tack a couple of times. Find the opening and turn the fabric right side out. Either slip stitch the opening close or top stitch to close the gap. And there you have it. That's how you make a scrunchie. I hope you had fun. This is like the first kind of real thing we made, like accessory. So um, yeah, I say your homework is just to practice your scrunchies. And since it really doesn't take much time and a scrunchie is always kind of like fun to have, you can try out um, this method with different sizes of elastic and fabric. I know I like my scrunchies really big. So if you like that too, then you can make it. And yeah, that's about it. So I will see you tomorrow.